Hello friends, my name is Taufik and you're watching my channel Graphics 10. So today we are going to create a t-shirt mockup in Photoshop. So I have chosen this image. I have downloaded this image from unsplash.com. You can choose whatever image that you like. In this particular example, we are going to place a logo onto the t-shirt and create a t-shirt mockup. Now there are different ways to do it, but we are choosing a very simple method that anyone can easily do it so I have created this logo so I'm going to put it over the t-shirt and first of all I'm going to convert this into a smart object right click smart objects smart object so that the quality of the logo doesn't get compromised but it is not that necessary to actually convert it to a smart object but still I have converted this into a smart object First of all, we need to remove this logo, which is already there. So I'm going to select this using the polygonal lasso tool. You can choose any tool that you want, select it and using the right click and fill option. Now need to click on the background first, right click, fill and content aware. Okay. So it will remove the logo that is already present there now the reason i have chosen this particular image that you can see there is a lot of difference between the highlights these are the highlights and the shadows so the difference is more so it is more difficult you can say it is more difficult to apply a mock-up or create a realistic looking mock-up in this particular t-shirt but still we can do it very easily as you can see in this particular area the whatever image is there or whatever print is there it shouldn't be visible if you uh, if you are speaking realistic realistically so i'm going to place this i have already placed this now this area should be not shouldn't be visible because it's in the shadows it is barely visible this part of the t-shirt is barely visible because there is no light over there so it shouldn't be visible and to make this realistic we need to make it the like the material present on the t-shirt or the t-shirts material if only then it will look realistic we also need to show these folds on the t-shirts so we are going to simply use right click blending options or you can simply double click over here now from the blending options itself general menu blending options we have blend if option so if you are confused about this blend if option you can simply slide these sliders and try it out unless and until you use this option you won't get uh, used to it and once you try using this you will understand by yourself so now we are using this underlying layer now if you see if i move this it will disappear but we need to split this point this particular point by press and hold alt key or option key and click so it will get split now now this is already looking realistic now as you can see this area should be not shouldn't be visible because it's in the dark it's in the shadows so this will give us a realistic look now this will increase the contrast as you can see this will increase the contrast and if you take it to the left it will decrease the contrast so stop whenever you are happy with the result so i think this looks pretty good to me this particular thing as you can see we can also see the folds and this area over here because it's in the dark it is barely visible so it is looking realistic and also we can see the material of the t-shirt that is threads and all we can see that's why it is looking realistic so i will press ok so now it is looking realistic i will show you one more time by placing this logo again over the top of, top of it like this now this is the logo that is that we took at the first place that is not looking realistic but as we apply the options it is looking realistic now so it is very easy to create a realistic t-shirt mock-up 
using this particular option blend if option so try it out now if you are still not happy with the result you can always play with the opacity like this but i i think this is looking pretty good to me so this is how we can create a t-shirt mock-up using very simple method in photoshop so try it out this is very useful because clients usually when we design logos and so many so many designs uh, designs it is better to put them into put them onto t-shirts and so many other pro products so that the client understands it how it actually looks so it is very important to create realistic looking mockups so do try this out and if you find this video useful give this video a like and subscribe to my channel i will see you in the next video until then bye bye and cheers